Greetings, my Maverick Hunters, and welcome back to more Mega Man X4 Blind for the PS1. In this episode, we're going to be taking on another Maverick. Last time, we took out the, uh, snow fella. <laughs> I've already forgot the damn thing's name. Oh my goodness. And I saw that there was a heart tank, which was in the mice block, so my suspicion to that is to next go to the volcano one. I don't see why not, we're obviously going to get a fire power up and I really want to get that hard tank. The more that I get, the the more hard tanks that I get, the easier it'll be, obviously. I don't know why I'm making it sound like I'm a scientist, but still. Magma Dragoon! That's quite an easy name to remember. What's the thing going to say though? He betrayed the irregular hunters and hid himself inside a volcano. What an ass. <laughs> anyway, cool. Let's just go, shall we? I wonder what the soundtrack as well is going to be like on this one, since I like the uh, the calmness, actually, of the, the slow level. It actually made me feel quite relaxed, not going to lie. Even though there was like a tense moment of things going through. Oh my goodness. Um, okay, okay, okay. Let's probably proceed on with a little bit of caution, shall we? Avoiding all of the, the magma rocks. I'm going to be gushing a lot through the art style of this game. It's just so, so beautiful. Like, oh my goodness, every color palette I'm just marveled at. They really, really outdid themselves when it comes to this. I have no idea, though, uh, what the fifth one's going to be like. Mega Man X5, since apparently a lot of you want to see me uh, tackle through that as well. Can I break these? Oh, I can, okay. That makes things a little bit easier for me. Considering I, like, ruined the, the thing in order to go for it. Let's see, let's see if I destroy that. Yeah, because then two of them come at once, didn't they? Okay, I see. So I just gotta do that in order to make it through a lot easier. Just need to break a whole bunch of them, do I? Easy as pie. Kind of. Now, oh boy, I just remembered. Sigma stages in this, isn't there? I wonder how the Sigma stages are gonna go whenever I'm gonna try and play for this game. I imagine it's gonna be quite difficult. Since most of the time I always have troubles with Sigma stages. I mean, I've beat Mega Man X1 a lot of times, but... Even I can struggle with the Sigma stages in that one, right? In fact, I feel like I'm the only person who struggles an awful lot, by the way, with the bloody spider boss <laughs> in uh, Sigma stage number one of the first game. And uh, there's just something about it that always puts me on edge. I don't think it's the fact that it's a spider, it's probably more the fact that um, you, you really have to have fast reaction times in order to go through it. I wonder when the heart tank in this stage, though, is going to be. Oh wait, can I actually... Oh wait, no, 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 uh, oh, no, 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 I had this on Pat, man. Okay, yeah, I gotta do this, of course. So it's just a thing in order to hide from it. Right, okay, how many was there actually falling down? Wait, did that stop? I think it stopped. Yeah, it stopped. Okay, sweet, never mind, we'll just progress on there. Um... Okay. Area 2. Is there like two areas of each of the levels? I am ready, yes. I'm also going to try and not use my dash all the time since there's no need for it. It's like even when you play Mario, you don't have to hold down dash at all times since sometimes it can sometimes cost you your death. Especially when timing's involved. Oh god, they are destroying the rocks. How intense. Oh my goodness me. Alright, okay. Let's just go through like this maybe. Sweet. I kind of think that there was something up the top of there. There was probably something up the top of there that I've missed, except, oh wow, I can actually just go to the left anyway to get it. Sweet. That's fine by me. Oh, there's a heart tank! Hey, can I actually go and get that like this? I am hoping that I can. Because, especially if I did a, a massive... Oh, wait, hold on. I might be able to do this. Just at the very... Exact pixel. Here we go. Beautiful. Look at that. Right. Okay. So now, yeah, that obviously extends my health just like all the other ones. In fact, did it do that? I don't know if it did. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. It happened so damn fast. I didn't really see a difference. But never mind. Cool. At least that one's all uh, taken care of. Anyway. I still don't even know what this ice power I've got. You know, this one right here. Imagine it's to protect me from something. Okay. Yeah. So it's, it's literally just a shield. And it's something to protect me from the scum fire, right? I, I might be wrong about that, but still. Wow, these things are way easier. <laughs> in the Super Nintendo uh, of the Mega Man X's, whenever I came across those, yeah, those things were a pain in the ass in order to go through. Now, I wonder if there's also going to be a sub-tank in this one. 
reasons. I, I think I know what they look like now. But I'm not 100% sure. Oh, wow, well, what the? Ooh! Look at this. Can I fly? No, but I can dash, right? Yeah, I can dash and do this. Oh, <laughs> before that, though, hold on, wait. Is there anything up there before I uh, progress on? Let me, uh, let me just see if there is. Well, I mean, we got this, but I can't seem to take care of that. Wait, what the? Uh, oh, well, right, no, that was ice. I, I, I was... Wait, is that needed to destroy this? Okay, let's do this probably, like, uh, three or four more times. Just out of my curiosity. Even tells me of the number that I have left of things. Wow. It doesn't look like it. No, it's it's kind of just doing that. Okay. Since it was reacting, but it wasn't really doing much. Anyway, right, let's just go through here on this mech. So what can I do with this? I can do like this giant sword slash, like Zero. Hey, that's awesome. Oh, I'm kind of looking forward as well to what Zero's story is going to be like whenever I play through this. That's going to be awesome. Although, is it going to have like... Oh, wait. Can I just... Oh, I can just walk through the lava. Or Magma in this case, sorry, yeah, it's called Magma Dragoon. Magma Dragoon? Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm pretty sure it's called Magma Dra Dragoon. I always kind of get mixed up, though, with that other PS1 classic, which I have yet to play. Oh, I see, and if I keep this, now it gives me an alternative pathway, and I can get through here easier? Oh, God! Whoops! I didn't mean to get to the end of the flipping stage, man! I, I, I kind of want to go back. Hello, how are you doing? Are you going to say anything? Dragoon X, you've arrived. Dragoon! Why did you portray uh, the headquarters? Apparently Me Mega Man X is like Sonic or something. That's the kind of voice that I was going for for some reason. It's probably just because he's blue. Heh, <laughs> you'll have to defeat me first. But, we're allies. Indeed, you betrayed. You're so naive. Listen closely. I let the Sky Lagoon fall. And I do it again. Ha 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 ha. No! Those were the innocent people. You're not Dragoon, just a maverick. You got that right. Power up, X. It's time you showed me what you can do. I thought he was going to say, show me what you're made of. And I'm like, wow, this really is Sonic. <laughs> Crazy. All right, so I can actually take you out of my mech, can I? So can I still get damage by this thing? I imagine that I can. Um, well, this is something. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> so, I'm assuming I'm supposed to take him out normally, but because I'm in my mech, it kind of... Yeah, there we go. Okay, now let's take him out for realsies. I was just kind of curious to see how long that would actually last before he did his thing. Oh my god, he's seen Shoryuken and stuff. Look at this. This is awesome, man. Okay, hold on, wait. Uh... Sub tank? <laughs> Better than nothing. Oh, that's not even a sub tank. That's for the... That's for the thing. That's for the thing. I'm gonna die. If I'm not too careful, yeah, I'm gonna die. I very nearly beat him in one shot, though. Very nearly. Never mind. Let's uh, progress on. I know what I'm doing now. Right, now, instead of actually relying on my mech, how about I actually pay attention to the attack pattern? That might help me out a ton. <laughs> and I'm already not doing that great. Oh, I see, yeah, so it's all dependent of which way he fires stuff, so he does things above as well. Got it, okay. So he's gonna do it above then... Oh, I can even just jump! Okay, that probably makes things easier for me. Yeah, just jump. Because I was kind of curious to see if that one would avoid me, but I guess not. I don't even have to dash on this, man. This is great. Oh, wow. No, 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 he's changing it up a tad. He's changing it up just a smidge. Oh, can you please not do that, sir? Thank you. Jesus, man. One more hit, maybe? Dude! Oh, come on! I just got him as well! I just had him! I just had him! How in the bloody Christ? Oh, I get it. Okay, I think. I think I get how I'm supposed to avoid that one. Can you just do your thing, please, sir? Wow, he's actually quite difficult. Okay, yeah, I need to wall jump on this. Got it. Okay, that's what he's saying. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, it doesn't even have, like, music. It's just mission failed. Stage select or save? Uh, continue. Puts me back to the beginning, though, doesn't it? No, it just even just puts me back to area two. 
It puts me back to area two. I was kind of expecting this to be at the beginning. Okay. Wait, hold on, dude. I don't know what I'm telling him to hold on, but still, there we go, finally. Wow. The mech does make that a lot easier, doesn't it? It's just such a shame how when I kind of jumped out, um, that was my side to learn his attack move. Newfoundland learned, don't actually go into a boss, and when you have a mech, just bash the hell out of them. Kind of pay attention to what they do as well. Multitask, a thing I'm not very good at. You are strong X such a waste why Dragoon always wanted to fight you then he appeared and he appeared who told me to work the Repli Force to goad to goad you into fighting. You did it just so you could fight me? It was worth it. For a final duel. Dragoon! Oh, I see. It's telling me a couple of things, huh? And now I got Rise and Fire. Very poorly done, though. At least now I can get the heart out. Shoots fire energy vertically. Sweet. Effective against all airborne enemies. I am an idiot. I just realized I did not once use the ice power up. This is a common thing that I'm always doing. Some objects may be burned by this attack as well. Like ice. To the snow base. Ready. Ready. All right, we are here. And now let's do the thing. Oh, wait. He shoots it. Oh, we are course, rising. Rising. Rise and flame! What happens when you shoot a flame, which is called the riser? It rises. It rises. Beautiful! Check that out. And now that is more heart tanks added to for me. Um, yeah, no. <laughs> that's it then. We're, we're done. Um, I'm just gonna escape out of it. I'm gonna see why not. Assuming, like, it keeps it anyway. Does it keep it? Please keep it. Yay, yeah, it keeps it. I love how I can keep track of all this, man. I'm so used to just kind of collecting stuff along the way and looking at the health bar, but now you have reminders. It's way more accessible. And this is great. I love this game so far. This is fantastic. As for which Maverick we're going to go for in the next episode, I have honestly no idea. So yeah, in the next episode of Mega Man X4 for the PlayStation 1. And the Blind Edition, I guess. I don't know where I'm going with this. We will be taking on another Maverick. Which one? Let's find out in the next one. Take care, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. And I will see you in the next one. That doesn't mean we're going to go on Air Force, by the way. I just thought I'd time it with the music. Goodbye.